technology is like ridiculously advanced. I mean, did you see the animatronics literally jumping around and stuff? I mean, yeah. Well, I mean, you gotta remember, William had insanely advanced robots in the 80s. Well, like, William the yeah. entertainment is insanely advanced. Yeah, sure. Yeah. I mean, uh, they, they can walk around. And... Okay, the way the glam rocks. I don't think them being able to walk around is the most fascinating thing about them, but. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Yo guys, I'm playing Duck Season. Cool. After all these years. I I mean I I played it a few days ago. Yeah I, yeah I know. Yeah. Then why are you questioning me only now? Because the game came out years ago. And yeah. it's really fun. It is. Yeah, that's I, why I I'm playing it. About the security breach tra trailer, actually, which is what I guess we're supposed to be talking about. Um, oh yeah. This is not necessarily about the trailer, but it's about security breach. Yeah. Um, but um, something I noticed is that the staff bots, their eyes are glowing, and they, like, the tears, they look like the... Nightmare on. Dead kid sprites. Yeah. So I, I feel like they might be possessed, honestly. It looks like it's um, going to be in, like, those trash tunnels that... You know, you did you see those trash tunnels in the trailer? Yeah. Yeah. Um, I feel like that's um, going to be the finale of the game. Like, wh whatever's happened to Afton is going to be under there. And, like, Afton is, like, the final boss. I doubt you'll defeat him, but... Um, to me... And I feel like the staff bots are, like, under the, and the trash. Kind of like it said, in your dreams on their stomach or something. To, to me, it yeah. looks like those... They look like if, um... Nightmarian, the Holo Neighbor Mannequins, and the Mini Arenas had a threesome. Ooh, <laughs> oh, no, hey. oh. Okay, okay, yeah. It would, it would make that. I, I feel like uh, Thunder Man may have joined me too. Oh shoot! Oh, oh, no. Bring that, that tentacle head tie. Oh wow! Mm. Oh god, no. Oh god. What have I, what have I done if I I'm a, that? Hey guys, I became a giant. This is your fault, Libra. This is your fault. Yeah, this is your fault. Yeah, your, yeah, oh wow, they did not play. model this house. I didn't know how I was <laughs> The monkey and the I cat tricks have a work in progress design of what uh, I think the after amalgamation might look like. If I can get a picture of it. I really hope the after amalgamation looks awesome i like i i don't want it i think oh yeah really lame. or the it's quote at after the yeah. I, 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 I don't want to be glitch trap i really i really do think we're gonna get the afton amalgamation in uh, the game not exactly the afton well, amalgamation but a but like a quote like just in quotations <laughs> after amalgamation yeah. i guess well it would be uh, super lame though it was just glitch trap Awkward silence. Yeah, uh, <laughs> it's in the art thing in the server. Even though it's literally just the head. <laughs> One thing I just noticed, that it uh, almost looks like a transformer. Well, I guess Afton's a transformer then. Yeah. Well, Dougie kind of is a transformer if you think about it. I wonder if Afton killed all the transformers and used their parts to make an algamation. <laughs> No, that's yeah, the that's transformers are the end, are the is the remnant. Oh uh, yeah. Remnant. Actually, the transformers are actually the dead kids in the far future. Oh my god. I want the Where golden bullet. It, uh, How do you get the golden bullet? We need we need to contact Matt Pat and the game theorists about all our amazing theories. I mean, Frankenstein is connected to Five Nights at Freddy's. <laughs> She's connected. Do you have a goal? Wait, I got a better idea. What if the Desolate Hope is connected to FNAF? Yeah, I mean, it is. <laughs> uh, what if the Desolate Hope is actually dead children? Or VR? What if... Guys, 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 I have an insane theory you're not gonna believe me. 
What? What if in FNAF, kids die? Oh my god. Oh, no. No. <laughs> no. No, I have, I have even, no even better one. For that. I have, I have <laughs> no better evidence. One. What if in FNAF, the animatronics have ghosts in them? The animatronics. Oh, the animatronics. Oh, what is the animatronics. Whoa, whoa, wait. I got a better one. I got a better one. I got a better one. What? 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 Can I throw this? Is purple. Oh. He, well, he's not. <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> like, he literally is not. Really, dude? <laughs> Bro, you just ruined the point of this game. I have a theory. Purple represents what? shadows. Doesn't everybody what? know that at this point? <laughs> yeah, I'm not saying the animatronics are actually nightmares. I just have a, Bruh. I just had a theory. <laughs> I, I, I had a theory. <laughs> what, what if um, Fredbear actually has a black cat and black bow tie and he's Golden Freddy because purple represents shadows in the minigames? Boom. He's not, so... Again, you're ruining the point of the game. Okay. What if Freddy has a cat and he's Golden Freddy? You're insane. I think Razabowski made that theory. Yeah, contact Razabowski, please. Yes. Razzle got weird in his 10 out of 5 ducks in trailer 15 reaction seconds. To the security breach trailer? He was like, um, when, um, Moondrop said, boy. He was like, punish me, daddy. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> That's Wait, literally what he said. One. If Glitchtrap is made by the screens of purple and yellow, would that confirm Will Plush? I don't think so. I actually don't believe Will Plush anymore. Um, mostly because of Friendly people. Face. I, I was Will Plush, like, a lot earlier in the year. I actually do still think Will Plush works pretty well, I but, like, I, I feel like the reasons people say it doesn't work are kind of stupid. All I really see is the Possessed Render Plush merch. Um, the main proof, like, against Will Plush is just proof for Charlotte Plush in Friendly Face. Like, it's, it's really, pr like, I, based on uh, Ozone's video on, um, like, his friendly face theory, that was really interesting to me. And that kind of made, that just kind of made me think, um, Charlotte plush is true. Which, I, I always thought Charlotte was the Fred plush in the Post Night 6 minigame, but through the rest of the game, I'm not like sure. It, was, it doesn't, um, didn't really make sense before. Friendly face. Yeah. How well, actually, you first, it's not I definitely don't think it's Cassidy. Not Cassidy. <laughs> or, um, bike victim. I don't. I don't. I don't think Cassidy plush is true at all. Yeah. No. Hell no. I never really did. Who here likes popsicles? I wait a minute. I think I know where this is going. No. 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 Nope. I don't like popsicles. Why not? Get a little Herbert. I hope I haven't accidentally shot the dog, because I'm trying to get the ending where I don't do that. Hold on, Libra, you said bopsicles instead of popsicles, so is no, there No, I popsicles? said popsicles. Popsicles? Uh, Although they are real, think, real popsicles. I think popsicles. you got the wrong house, Herbert. Uh, Chris is over there. What if every single copy of FNAF is personalized? <laughs> no, not what? that again. Today, you know, guys, today at lunch, um... Me and my friends went went to Walmart because we there's a McDonald's in our Walmart in the Walmart near our school, so we usually go there to eat. Um, and we like, but we started going around Walmart after we finished eating because like we were kind of bored. And we went to like the electronic section, and we actually saw the um, the core collection. I found and I found that kind of cool, like wow. in in the game section. Wow. So. The core, um, the joy of creation. I said the no, core collection. The collection was done kind of badly. What's the core collection? Like the like the game on the the first four games on console. Oh, the first, okay. first five games. Yeah, this location. Location. Yeah, I feel bad oh. for you guys. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it only said the first four, so I don't know. I don't really. Know. Three, I no, it's, it's, it's been app one through four in sister location. Oh, huh, okay. Yeah, I'm I'm here for FNAF for the weird lore that I like. And the designs and the atmosphere. Okay. I don't think they did the cord collection very well. Yeah. 
What do you mean, like the 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 ports, or just like overall? Did. Well, something I hate Wait. that they did with the FNAF remastered stuff. You know how they um fixed old things on it. Um, I hate that they changed the menus. I get that they had to do that, but I just miss the old menu themes. Don't Wait. let ten yeah. ducks get past. I gotta here. ask you something. Have any of you ever heard of Dormitibus? I have, but I've never played oh, it. Yeah, yeah. 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 The yeah. designs in that themes are terif they're terrifying, honestly. Those yeah. designs with the cake bear. Yeah, I love Am I Real and Garvey, even though Garvey was he was he was controversial because uh yes, he raped the fifteen year old girl. And unfortunately the creator blackout was confirmed to be a pedophile and a necrophile. Oh, so shoot. Like, Wait, the creator's a pedophile? Unfortunately, yes. Uh, oh, just like um, just like oh. the person who um, I feel like that's always unfortunate. You know Mando Pony? Do, do you all know who Mando yeah. Pony is? Oh yeah, he he's a pedophile. He's the one who made like the FNAF songs adjust gold and survive the night. Yeah, I feel popular like and honestly kind of good FNAF songs, but he's shoot. A crazy I had the gold the golden bullet. I think. God damn it! It always what? sucks when like a creator of something that's like really good. Oh yeah, is, I know. Uh, like that. Turns out, well, I do learn this lesson. Always distinguish uh, creator from creation, art from art, artist. Do you from guys art. know the movie Jeepers Creepers? Have you all heard that movie? I've heard of it and watched um, it. I've heard the phrase. <laughs> the director of that movie is a pedophile. He Oof. did stuff to uh, an eleven year old boy. I'm just glad this got is not a pedophile. Yeah. Yeah, Why are everyone pedophiles nowadays? I'm just glad that he he is not like that. At but the worst thing he done was vote Republican, which isn't even honest, a crime. Honestly, that's, that's, that's honestly that's what that's what he wanted to do. I mean, you can't really argue with him. He he's an American citizen. He can really do whatever he wants. Why do people hate Republicans? Yeah, most of my family are Republicans, so I was just confused. Like, why is he being canceled for this? There are very nice people who are Republicans, and very nice yeah. people who are. Oh, you talk to here. Not the great people, but um, nice. Scott Conklin is a nice guy. He's proved that many times. Very nice. Yeah, I feel like, uh, and I kind of feel bad for you people. Uh, I live. I remember when I literally graduated school last year, okay, yet I'm still on Discord. My mom's side of my family is Republican. Yeah. It's like, well, I guess, I guess that makes us all bad. There we go. Okay, my headphones yeah, unplugged. Uh, I'm going to the Twitter degenerate to uh, have nothing better to do. Or the if you're not. If you're not a hard Twitter, Twitter is disgusting. Uh, apple, according to Twitter, the people on Twitter are so just stupid. I mean, they won't let you yes. have an. If you're a Republican, they instantly hate you. I mean, you just, I'm, I'm neither Democratic or Republican. I'm, I'm neither. But I mean, let's be honest. I think Twitter is ran by a bunch of monkeys. <laughs> Monkeys. I mean, Scott said this in his, like, reply to all that stuff, but, I mean, it's... Actually, he was getting yeah, death like, death it, it was like the It was like the lesser of two evils. Like, what could he have really done? Did, did people yeah. even read what Scott had to say about the drama? Yeah, people don't like the discussion He had a very great response. Be honest, had a very I, respectful response. I take back what I said about the monkeys. Even monkeys are more intelligent than that. Like, <laughs> saying yes, that Twitter is for monkeys is an insult to monkeys. <laughs> That's an insult to monkeys. Yeah. The monkey kind. You guys, how much do you want to bet that I accidentally shot the dog once? Oof. Ouch. Did you shoot the I, dog? I had, a, I had a nightmare about duck season once. The hell? Have you been hunted by ducks? <laughs> yeah, like, like, I, no, like, I, I was in my house. Okay, I don't care about the six o'clock news. And, uh, I remember the, the fucking dog just, like, ran up the stairs and killed me. What? Wow. Oh. Okay, then. 
At least it was nice and straight to the point. At least there, at least he has more mods than the Nightmare animatronics who just don't kill you instantly. They love to the torment you. Rather play Duck Hunt than play Duck Season. What? I get to shoot the ducks, and then the dog who, if I fail to shoot a duck, I can just shoot him and say, hey, fuck you. <laughs> duck, yeah, season duck season is epic. Duck VR. Plus, plus the dog is a murderer. I'll tell you guys a that comes to real life. Well, to be fair, the dog only attacks you if you shoot it. Yeah, but, I mean, it still happens. Just don't shoot the dog. Hey. And you'll How be fine. Cool. That's what, that's the ending I'm trying to get right now. I'm trying to get the ending where you don't shoot the dog. Yeah, I gotta ask you. How do you feel about the Alpha Z robots? I do. I don't even know what Alpha Z groups means. I mean, it, uh, what is that? Alpha Z Z Z Z the security breach the trailer. I know. I, I know that was in the. Six. That was in the first Freddy and Friends, but it was so. What does Alpha Z groups mean? I don't know. Shoot. I guess it's so staff. I guess there's like six groups. So it's obviously not blocks. a mistake because I had something similar in the next ones. But to be honest, I love the design of them. I love the faces of them. I even have it as my new profile for for crying out loud. <laughs> yeah, I saw. I yeah, noticed. They, they look like um, real versions of the um, dead kids. Yeah, I thought. A little bit, yeah. Cool. Yeah, I think, I, think they I feel like they have some connection to the puppet with how similar they look to the to Nightmare on. Plus the tentacle stuff and Lefty's re apparent return in FNAF AR, it seems like the puppet's returning. Yeah, so... so I feel like they have yeah, some like, connection. Kids. Like, that, like, Lefty's gonna actually be in AR. <laughs> I mean, yeah, like, but... Canonically, um, he probably is. Have like, burned as well. But, for us, probably not. I yeah. think there is a lore planned with the NAF AR, and it just, it's just, that's just The NAF AR happen. is a mess, and that game is not canon besides the emails, and that's... The game is canon, saying. it's just, yeah, like... Yeah, and the spring trap. You, you tell me Clown Spring, spring trap, trap is canon? Clown Spring Trap and Woodland Toy Story? I mean, I mean, I don't know if the skins are canon, but if they do, if they are, they don't have any lore significance. They're just no, there. There's no way they're sending out the spring trap either. They're not sending out spring trap to. Actually, they are. 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 Actually, Actually, wait. I think they are that, but it's not supposed to happen. I think Vanny like added the spring trap models into the deployment but roster. Spring, so hey, spring spring trap yeah, and then Fazbear Entertainment is just dumbasses. Yeah, cause. <laughs> and then they're just like, "Hey, let's just make a let's just make skins for him because why not?" Yeah, yeah. Fazbear Entertainment's the type of company <laughs> to be like, guys, how about we make you bumper cars but with actual cars? Yo, am I done yet? Oh yeah, we're gonna try vehicles. Yeah, Cadver came and ran by a bunch of idiots. How about we make plastic knives, but replace the plastic How do I insert this? With real blades. How do I put this in? I should never say that again. Um, how do I... What do you guys think of, uh, Vanessa Afton? Eh. I actually kind of like that. That's kind of the case. Um, I you. It kind of defeats like the per the whole entire purpose I mean, of Glitch it's Trap, obvious though. William had some affairs and stuff. I, I, I don't think William ever had a wife. I highly doubt that. Because well, there's no... Um, I feel like William Afton was fully. just, you know, was just doing some Rule 34 with random women. So he basically, so he basically hooked up with some random... So basically you think... So basically, yeah, you yeah, think William Afton is a um, is a murderous a whore. whore. Have you guys ever heard of the movie American Psycho? I have with with Christian Bale. You mean right? I haven't watched it, but I've heard it's really good. By my brother. Christian Bale in that movie, just like he seems normal, like a normal Wall Street guy, whatever. But 
is really just like a, the psychopath who lashes Yay! out. Yay! I I got the think... I got the nuke ending, so now I have to replay the entire game again to to get the non shooting the dog ending. Okay, yay! <laughs> Wait, do you think that? Do you just think that Michael, bite victim, and Elizabeth all have different moms? There's no way Michael's the bite victim. That series just makes no sense. There's yeah, yeah, we, yeah, 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 we know. I don't think My, that's Mike what he was saying. No, he was saying Michael bite victim and Elizabeth, not Michael the bite victim and Elizabeth. Oh, oh, yeah. Okay, can I skip the credits, please? <laughs> God damn it! No. Now he's just screaming out all the names of the credit people. Like, even if uh, William did have a wife, it probably doesn't really matter. I, I doubt he had a wife. I, I'm saying, I bet he hooked up with a bunch of random people. I mean, that just seems like... And that just makes sense. I don't know. <laughs> New theory, yeah, Will Whore. And he looks like the He looks like the first one. Will Whore, the best theory ever. Yes, Will Whore. Will Whore. There's somebody in the credits named Michael. Sorry. I actually believe the, uh... Spencer. Ballora, Ballora Afton. No, I believe Funtime Family. I mean, Spencer I, believes some weird, some weird stuff like um VR before six, does. but like, um Funtime Family. That's a good theory. It's a good theory. I remember one yeah. called Funtime Victim, where I the bite victim is Funtime Freddy. Yeah, actually, yeah. I actually kind of like that theory. Or I don't think I don't can. the theory no the the um like the story could be cool that. but um, I don't I disagree with a lot of Matt Pat's theories um I think that um oh there's no more credits I think that, um I think that um Golden Freddy and Cassidy uh, um, oh Golden yo Freddy what's up yo what's up doggy uh, why are you bloody okay hey don't hurt him don't hurt him man Nah, he's just hugging him. Okay, now he disappeared. Alright, so, go on. <laughs> so, about Springtrap's modeling for NAF AR, uh... What? The model is great. I have no problem with the model. Yeah, I like it. I think it's the best model it, of Springtrap. I agree, but the only issue I have with it is, despite being made of cloth, he's metallic. He has a reflection on it. Yeah, I mean all the animatronics in FNAF AR do, and they're all basic. They're all just um, they're all just replicas anyway, so it doesn't really matter that much. Yeah, like but yeah. let's, I can see the gore being like uh, being shiny because of how wet it is, and the endoskeleton. But mainly why would it still be wet, bro? It's been it, it would have been like. But that's assuming that Williams. I mean, it is a replica. It is a replica, so yeah. Maybe they would have made it shiny or whatever. I don't know, but well, um, I just I don't know. one thing: when William moves, uh, when William moves, when Springtrap moves, you actually hear gore swishing. Yeah, you're like. <sighs> so that's why I thought he might have been the real Springtrap at first. He is not. Maybe the, I mean I, I, I mean there does seem to be there does seem to be dead bodies in there. There could be dead bodies in there, and like it's somebody yeah, else. Maybe, uh, Maybe Vandy might have created how, uh, created the He might have, who knows, he might have cloned William and have them all sewn into the Springtrap suit. Or, or just took some random dead bodies and turned them into Springtraps. Or built a bunch of different Springtraps so that, um, William can infect all of them and so he'll be truly immortal. Yeah, I think maybe. I think I, that's. I, I think that's probably how it's gonna go. I think the spring trap balls might be partially possessed by glitch trap. That they're his new vessels. Kind of like uh, the war need to pull from uh, Halo Five. How he has multiple bodies. If you ever played uh, Halo Five. I've never played any of the Halos. <laughs> Yeah, but he is kind of like a character who has one mind but multiple bodies. I think it might be the same thing for Springtrap in FNAF AR. Or at least with the Springtrap CPU has has a piece of William's soul inside of it. Yeah, yeah. 
think it corrupts so itself. I think, I think just the FNAF... I just think the FNAF AR CPUs are all, like, spare circuit boards that have parts of... How, that are, like, scanned... That were, like, left over from the game that are infected with glitch trap. Yeah. I think, uh... I think the Springtrap clones are definitely possessed. Or at least partially possessed by William. That they're his own personal bodies. Wait. I got an idea. What if the Afton amalgamation and security breach is made out of the Springtrap clones? Eh. Uh, I mean, it could be, but I don't know about that. I think that would be awesome if they were made out of the different Springtrap models from FNAF AR. It would be interesting if the Pizza Flex is where the FNAF AR characters are made. Yeah. What if, like, uh... The or that's like where you it. sign up for the service or something. I still don't need the spring trap yeah. clone thing. I mean, that just doesn't make sense. Why would um, Fast Bear Entertainment like make a bunch of spring traps? <laughs> How do they even what? know it exists? It doesn't eat um, because I think um Fast Bear's fright um, is not an official Fast Bear Entertainment location. Like it could. I mean, it, it uh, it's not a Fast Bear Entertainment location, but they definitely know about it considering FNAF Three. Uh, is in FNAF VR. Yeah. I think it was just made by a bunch of phone dude like people like, hey man, we're making a Fazbear's Fright, blah blah. I don't think it's from Fazbear Entertainment. Phone dude yeah. is Dwayne from what we found. Head cannon. I don't think I don't think what we found is canon. I thought yeah. Well yeah, it's obviously not. I'm just saying like head cannon. Yeah. yeah. I, when I was reading and maybe a parallel, was, maybe a parallel to Phone Dude. Thinking, oh, one of them is Phone Dude. <laughs> if one of them is, then it's definitely Dwayne. I think. Yeah. Even though I still think the. Hey, I'm glad he came back for yeah. another night. Ugh. That's my awesome Phone Dude. I saw a theory that Phone Dude is uh, the indie dev. Oh, <laughs> there's no evidence. Well, it's made by, by Mono. Well, I guess it's possible. Like, there's no evidence proving, saying, saying otherwise. I know. There's no I'm... evidence proving or disproving it. Yeah, so, it's I guess it's probably the same thing. Um, because, um, in the last call, he's like, he seems very rushed and he's like, gotta go, man. I wonder if, um, Springtrap killed him or something. That would be interesting. Yeah, I don't imagine he's dead. Eh, I doubt it. I, th I don't think he died. Um, I don't know. He seemed rushed, I thought. Like, what if something was going on? I mean, like, maybe. Maybe he kind of, like, died like his own guy. Maybe he's just gotta go do drugs with his buds, or maybe Springtrap's after him. I don't know. I mean, he is dude, not guy, so maybe he is... <laughs> Doing drugs. <laughs> Dude, drugs. New theory. Dude, drugs. Hey, hey, yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm from, uh, hey, man. Checked out this new item I found in Fazbear Fright. Found it in Fazbear Fright. Uh, <laughs> Dude, drugs. It's possible he didn't die in um, the FNAF 1 calls because, like, who knows, he could have survived. Or maybe he was trying to just, like, get out of the company. Because he, sa he said um, um, he's going to try to hold out in the suit. So what if he just... Yeah. He, I, think he, I just killed three ducks at once. I'm such a professional. I think he definitely tried to stay alive in the suit. but I, I don't think he would have, though. I thought he's dead, but it's possible he actually... Um, survived I, it'd be what if phone guy returned to the security breach i highly doubt that 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 would just be kind of fun <laughs> like if he did he'd probably be very 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 old yeah he'd be like in his 90s yeah, that um, would be kind of charming but like god damn you almost died you've been I'm sticking alone. with this pizza chain for 50 years <laughs> Why does no one talk about how Freddy Fazbear's Pizza is obviously a chain? Nobody talks about that. I don't know why. I always assumed it was just a local business. Um, no, no so in uh, FNAF 3, they talk about how there's like a lot of Freddy Fazbear's Pizza. Um, in, in the, um, the 
you if there's just one talks, haunted location or if there are multiple haunted locations. It, it, only one haunted it talks about location, how there's um, but... multiple locations. Also, in the newspaper where it talks about Fazbear Sprites burning, it says ancient pizza chain. Yep. Well, it is like 30 years old and FNAF. Wait, I got an idea. What year do you think Security Breach takes place in? I think like I, around I, the yeah. 30s. I think yeah, there's no evidence for the like maybe after um, FNAF 6, FNAF 4. After FNAF 6. Yeah. yeah. There you go. That's, that's why I figured. It's around the late 2020s and <laughs> early 20, early 2030s. Like it, it yeah, at least in 2030. I'm saying. Technology is, like, ridiculously advanced. I mean, did you see the animatronics literally jumping around and stuff? I mean, yeah. yeah. Well, I mean, you gotta remember... William had insanely advanced robots in the 80s. Well, like, William the entertainment yeah. yeah. is insanely advanced. Yeah, sure. Yeah. I mean, um, they, they can walk around. And... Okay, the way the glam rocks... I don't think them being able to walk around is the most fascinating thing about them, but... <laughs> okay. <laughs> they, they can, like... They can, like, uh... Run, they can jump. The way they move, it's definitely... The glam rocks. Yeah. I don't think that's an actual um thing. The gay foxy. I remember uh. Once Did you say gay foxy? Yeah, I heard that too. Even though I don't believe it at all. What do you think I said? I heard something about gay foxy. But hey, hey, no judgment here. No judgments. I actually have an idea if Manny is a separate character. I hope we get screens of her pulling her mask off like Springtrap and she looks like deformed and disfigured. She's not separate from Security no, Girl, so... Is security yeah, girl. I don't think that. I kind of know that. The security breach is... Actually, um, actually it was kind of... Vanessa is the name of the guard. It was so, actually kind of confirmed. In on, the leaked the emails. Website, and, like, and like the synop no, on the synopsis of the game, it says that the security has changed the animatronics programming to make them attack you. Yeah, that's the security. We all know Fazbear and Entertainment is a bunch of liars. I mean, I think they kind of cover up the fact that Okay, I think okay. the reason I think it's more like Blitztrap got into them because if it is the security system, then why would Freddy be helping Gregory? I mean, I think I think like Vanny just like infected them with Glitztrap or whatever. And, uh, actually, I have a good I have a good answer to that too. I have a good answer to that too. I have a good answer to that. In the trailer, so right, you have all the other charts, They're attacking Gregory, and then you see Freddy, yep. and Freddy's glitching. I think that here that the that the that Vanny switched their AI, but then Freddy glitched out and is now helping Gregory. That is His a good programming point. build. Makes yeah. sense. Yeah, um, I, I could think either say I think either programming or him possibly being possessed by Michael Lafton. Either one of those two. I, 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 I no. The only Glamrock in front of that's possessed. I, I, I don't think he's Michael Afton. If anything, if there's any set of souls in this game, I bet it's the FNAF 2 kids. We never got rest of their souls, and Cheetah just so happens to be Miss Andy. No, know, um, no, 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 no. I think. No, 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 no. I think. They're probably incinerated. There's no happiest way for the kids in FNAF 2. I don't think kids died in FNAF 2. Um, there is. I think, the, I think, I think there's. I think the shown in the Save the Minigame was representing the. Um, actual missing children's incident in the first. Except history. it wasn't because the animatronics like, were, had yeah, them stuffed actually, inside them. They were oh, stuffed well, inside the animatronics, and so, since Freddy is moving, that's already happened. So no. Yeah, and, and also so phone guy. Phone guy talks about it being at the new location. Yeah. Phone guy talks about a, a new missing children's incident at the new location. Or like a new this incident overall, and not really missing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, it, it, it's a new stab, kids. Um, plus, that's, like, there are these merch how, um, suits. I think it's creepy how in the next few um, calls, phone guy described how the 
wizard animatronic smell. I, think, I, just, I don't know why, but I think that's creepy. Just the, that how the corpses are still in the animatronics. Exactly. They're not then, in there during FNAF 2. They no, are. Sorry. They're just not in no, there after FNAF 1. They're probably like... Yeah. No, they... Yeah. They can't be in there during FNAF 2 because we even see inside of Foxy and. Yeah. No, um, I think they're in the. They're like in the. You don't see corpses inside of the. Inside of Foxy. You don't see. So I think that they may have been stuffed in a spare suit and then they possess the endoskeletons. Well, I had a theory that um, the FNAF 1 animatronics were actually made for like the first Freddy Fazbear's, and, but. Um, the wizard animatronics were spare suits, and like William Hefton stuffed um, that animatronics in the FNAF suits first, but then changed, the, the, but then took the corpses and put them in the withered animatronics. That was a confusing old theory of mine. I don't believe it anymore, but just a thought. Or the withereds are just upgraded after FNAF 2 and become the classics, but okay. Yeah. Yeah, I think that's they are probably, probably they melted down oh, the yeah. skeletons and uh, changed them. I, well, but that's not really. Ask, well, no. If I would ask, how would you feel about Michael Afton being Glamrock Freddy if it was true? No. Uh, yeah, I, mean, I don't think cool. it was. I, I mean, it'd be really kind of cool, but it'd be kind of weird at the same time. I like, like. I like. I kind of like the idea that Michael Afton is, um, helping now. Like. But, um, it's just kind of out of place, too. Like, I do kind of like the theory. Like, and I do kind of like the idea of it being built over, uh, the FNAF 6 location. Yeah, that's a cool theory, but, um, I'm still on the verge of thinking that FNAF 6 hasn't happened yet. I mean, like, I... It very clearly has. Cracking plush it, it said has. otherwise. What's the evidence I, that FNAF 6 has happened? I have not- Scrap baby it. plush. Scrap baby plush and help me- That's really that's all you really need. Really that's really, really all you need. I don't think everything in, um, Hub 1 in this canon, I mean- It is. Except the fact- <laughs> I mean, it is. How do they know I, about spring trap and- Fast versus frightened stuff and I mean they're they trying to the they're nightmare ever why wouldn't they know about it? They're they're trying to like discredit the rumors. That's the yeah, whole point of FNAF VR. Kind of, it's kind of just weird and confusing at the same time, but hey, to be fair, FNAF is weird and confusing. Except this part of of it isn't even. Like it's pretty simply spelled out for us. Yes. I remember what I used to think like you. I'm I'm sorry. I don't mean to make fun of you, like but I remember I was just more in denial because I just wanted to see, uh, I just wanted to see, I don't know why, I just wanted to see Springtrap, I just wanted to see Springtrap again. That's not a VR replica. Oh, also, also, um, in FNAF AR, the scrapped, uh, Faz Facts, they mentioned Rockstar Bonnie. Yeah, being, uh, made they from, do, yeah. uh, the classic Bonnie. Yeah. Yeah, so. Which, no, that does not prove Rockstar MCI. <laughs> no, I do not. <laughs> it's basically. Molten MCI is it, literally a fact. So that's confirmation okay. that. Fast facts have been, um, make no sense because um, they mentioned how um, in 1993, nighttime security job was voted most dangerous, but that doesn't make sense because. Um, the FNAF 1 location is supposed to be the only location then because they're on a low budget and um, if it was the most dangerous job in all of America that means there would have to be like a ton of FNAF locations or it's just so dangerous <laughs> like that's pretty yeah. simple <laughs> and also they mentioned how Fazbear's twisted pizza recipe was the most popular but why would they name their pizza recipe the Twisted Pizza Recipe? I know it's because... Because it's twisted. Yeah. They emphasize twisted, like... I don't think that makes much sense, but... Maybe there's twisted, uh... Breadsticks on the crust. I don't know. Yeah, I, I know that's what <laughs> it twisted is, recipe. but still, like, they they emphasize the twisted... I wanna go like, to Chuck E. Cheese. Chuck E. Cheese, I... like, disgusting food. I'm annoyed at the Chuck E. Cheese that I live near because instead of having like 
this was before they went bankrupt too. It's always been like this. Instead of having like the entire animatronic band, they just have one animatronic, and it's just Chucky. Oof. Yeah. I've never been to Chuck E. Cheese. Like I was. Yo guys, guys, I was like, I was in the car like a couple of weeks ago, and we, like, we passed by a Chuck E. Cheese, and I'm just like. Hold up! There's Chuck E. Cheese's around here, and I literally, I literally said to my mom, "We're just like, we need to go to Chuck E. Cheese one day," <laughs> and she was like, "Um, well, we'll see." I don't have any. I need it. I need it for a video. I need it for a video. Yeah. I need to go to Chuck E. Cheese for a video. Hey, sorry, dude. We don't allow recording in this Chuck E. Cheese. You're gonna have to put your camera down. I don't give a. Sh you know yeah, what? I'm gonna make we don't allow FNAF fans in here. <laughs> we don't allow FNAF fans in here. Yeah, because I'm gonna you guys apply for my first business. job, and I'm gonna apply for to be a night shift <laughs> guard at Chuck E. Cheese. Chuck e. Cheese. Sure, I want. I kind of want to be a night shift guard. I wonder if they have the truck to move around. Well, good thing there's only one of them. Good thing they're bolted to the freaking stage. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the silver eyes. If you've read the Silver Eyes, the animatronics were bolted to the stage and they just ripped their feet right off. Oh, really? Yeah, uh, that oh. was a detail. They're, it literally says that their mean, feet were bolted to the stage uh, and they just ripped their feet right off the stage. I'm fucked. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> it, just, it just, you see, just two big holes in the stage. <laughs> that was, <laughs> two big holes in the stage. Well, I don't think. I don't Honestly? Think Honestly, if I was able to, I'd be down. I'd be I'd be a night security guard at, at Chuck E. Cheese. In a heartbeat, I would take that job if it was offered to me. I wonder, I wonder well, how I think I I'm, uh, I'm 19, so they might hire me. I'm, yeah, I'm 14, so they won't hire me. They won't hire me because I don't know if... Can 17-year-olds be night shift guards? And 14-year-olds? <laughs> I'm gonna look up how much Chuck E. Cheese pays. <laughs> are you are you being genuine? Like you're actually you want to be a nice security guard? I, I'm curious how much it pays. <laughs> how old do you have to be to work there? I know I'm obviously too young, but probably uh, 18. So I'm 14, so I can't be a security guard yet. I, I'm yet. also 14, so yeah, no security guard for me. One oh, day though, one day though, I'm taking that job. If that was my life that. career, I would oh, be satisfied. I'm actually, I'm actually old enough to work at a Chuck E. Cheese. How old do you have to be? Sixteen. Oh, nice. Oh. Just got two more years. Same. <laughs> then I'll be able to. Oh, I thought you had to be uh, eighteen. Well, I. Or is that just Mike? Victim could work Why does no one bring a gun in Five Nights at Freddy's? I know I've said that, but seriously, just bring <laughs> a gun. Just bring a gun with you, man. You'll be good. I mean, Gregory's gonna get a laser tag gun. A <laughs> laser tag gun. I don't know. I'm not. Say hello uh, to my little friend. Say hello to my little friend. Wait, how old do you have to be to own a gun? Um, probably like 20. <laughs> maybe 18. Well, well, I, I guess one more year for I me. Think it could be 18 or something. I mean, I could okay, call the police right now, but I don't want to. Because <laughs> I want to get, I want to get the no shoot, I want to get the no shooting in, man, Dean. Um, imagine calling the police and they go, 911, what's your emergency? And you're like, oh, how old do you have to be to own a gun? <laughs> <laughs> I was, so I mean, imagine, <laughs> no, how, no, how yo, can I, yo, I'm 14, can I be a night security guard at Chuck E. Cheese? They're just like, no. Like, saying, like, um, and saying, how, um, how old do I have, do, um, I have to be to shoot a gun when there's, like, a murderer in your house and you gotta shoot them? <laughs> yeah. She's not hire security guards, cause I'm trying to see I think they how much that pays. I can't find Nah, man, if, if you're gonna call the police, it's gotta be because the guard in your video game knockoff of Duck Hunt came to life and is about to murder your mom. Because I'm from the future and I've and I've okay, done do this before. They, they do hire guards. Okay. Take the job, man. <laughs> Go get it. Wait, I'm a, this will be How my first job. No, like genuinely, I would actually do that. I would take that job if I could. And yeah. if I, like, um, as long as I have a weapon, I'll take the job. 
Focus this and the connector. I literally have a gun. I mean, I I would not be there without a gun. If there's animatronics there, <laughs> I'd bring a gun with me. Nah, I'd bring I'd bring like a baseball bat or something, or a toy lightsaber. I'm sorry, a baseball bat. Uh, yeah. Actually, toy lightsaber might be so good. <laughs> toy lightsaber. That's what I need. Yeah, yeah toy lightsaber. Yeah, that would work. Uh, I would prefer to bring a real lightsaber. <laughs> a real lightsaber. <laughs> Where are you gonna find that, bro? Where are you gonna find that, bro? Are you gonna go travel to the Death Star? Yeah. Oh shoot, dude! I just had the golden gun and I shot a, a duck that was flying over the sun. Thank God I didn't miss; otherwise, I'd have to restart again. <laughs> that would have been a big. That would have been a pain, yeah. in a nutshell. Like the definition well, of pain would be that. The definition of pain is life. The <laughs> life, yeah. Yes, that's fourteen, and that's D. Well, I guess I'm getting the job. I'll report if I see any, uh, weird-ass animatronics. 911 was your emergency. Oh, I'm being hunted by a, a seven-foot green bunny missing the ear. <laughs> I think there's a corpse in it, yeah. I, I yeah, they just hang up like, immediately. Can, they're just like, can shut up. I can try, uh, or something. just... They're just like, shut your mouth. Really high as shit. Maybe I'll try being the Chuck E. Cheese manager and uh, see if there's any weird things in the alleyway. Uh, <laughs> or you could... Let's see, if I can... Let's see if I can find the peanut man in the alleyway. Oh, wait. Oh, I think... Did my mom call me? I'm... She might have called me. I oh, yay! I got the Fiesta ending. Uh, I need to turn up the volume. I got the your mom ending. Nice, my favorite ending. Yeah. I got the Lady oh, okay. Dimitrescu ending. We don't talk about okay. it. Okay. Okay, yeah, yeah, I got the Fiesta ending. I got the Rule 34 ending. Wow! <laughs> nice. My favorite. I, I would have shot that annoying dog. Would you now? You know, later he kills you. Did you know that? It's really fun to see you dead on the floor, you b uh, I'll be right back. <laughs> as soon as I say that, you're just like, yeah, see ya. My throat hurts. Final oh, Fiesta yeah. 2. I'm super sick right now, but I'm still talking. Oof. I'm, 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 I'm badass, because I'm talking well. I'm more I mean, badass. Haha. -ha. Okay, so it's nighttime now. What exactly can I do? I want to use Kid Wait Wizard. Are, are you... Are, are, uh, buddy. Wait, did I just take the power out of the TV? I'll take the power out of your mom. Oh! Rick and Morty pajamas.